Hello guys, welcome back again. Here I want to read this article before I continue. Don't forget to like, comment, share this video, and also subscribe. Blockchain system used voting to decentralize governance and operation. While the exchange mechanisms for how voting and consensus are accepted, this for an each blockchain system. At a high level, blockchain system allow each user to vote and how the system should work and whether any given operation accepting a new block into the chain for example should be approved traditionally voting requires the, the identity of the people casting ballots can be known and verified to ensure that only eligible people vote and do so only once. Some blockchain system allow user to present an digital ID to prove their identity, enabling voting with enable energy usage. However, in most blockchain system, user are anonymous and have no digital ID they can prove their identity what then stops an individual from pretending to be many individuals and casting many votes there are several different approaches but the most uses is proof of work in proof of work user gets votes based on the amount of computational power they have in power promotion to other users, they demonstrate their ownership of this computational power by solving difficult mathematical problems. If one user can solve twice as many problems as another user, they have twice the computational power as other user and get twice as many votes. However, solving this mathematical problem is extremely energy intensive leading complaints the proof of work is not sustainable to this does record user to temporarily lock the asset in the blockchains for a period of time it is far more the efficient blockchain system use voting to decentralize governance and operation while the exchange mechanisms for how voting and consensus are accepted this for an each blockchain system. At a high level, blockchain system allow each user to vote and how the system should work. And whether any given operation accepting a new block into the chain, for example, should be approved. Traditionally, voting requires the, the identity of the people casting ballots can be known and verified to ensure that only eligible people vote and do so only once. Some blockchain system allow user to present an digital ID to prove their identity, enabling voting with enable energy usage. However, in most blockchain system, users are anonymous and have no digital ID. They can prove their identity, what then stops an individual from pretending to be many individuals and casting many votes. There are several different approaches, but the most used is proof of work. In proof of work, user gets votes based on the amount of computational power they have in power promotion to other user. They demonstrate their ownership of this computational power by solving difficult mathematical problems. If one user can solve twice as many problems as another user, they have twice the computational power as other users and get twice as many votes. However, solving this mathematical problem is extremely energy intensive, 
leading complaints the flow of work is not sustainable. So this does require this to temporarily look the set in the blockchains for a period of time. It is far more the efficient. That's all. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share this video, and also subscribe.